is a manufacturer of goods. His business is growing, and he just purchased a new building with an office and attached warehouse. He wants to make sure the right people have access as needed, so he doesn't have to allow entry every time. For example, he would like his warehouse supervisor to have access to the warehouse, but not to the office. The new alarm partitioning feature from Cox Business Security Services makes it possible for John to accomplish his goals. This new feature allows business owners to section off their alarm system into separate partitioned areas. Within the system, each partition is armed and disarmed individually and is monitored independently. Customers also have the flexibility to add up to three partitions to a primary detection system, allowing for a total of four separately monitored areas with up to 255 sensors installed and divided between the partitions. Partitions are for a single account. Customers cannot assign partitions to a different business. Also, keep in mind, partitions do not increase the total business serviceability policy. John isn't alone in needing to define partitions for his security system. Consider the following businesses. Restaurants with storage areas. Offices with public service and dining areas. Churches with separate daycare facilities. Gyms or fitness centers with office spaces. Car dealerships with separate sales, service, and office areas office buildings with departments or individual businesses with differing hours of operation, business owners who do not want user access to the entire system. Panel users can be assigned arm-disarm permissions for one or more partitions, so John can have a partition for his warehouse and office. If he wanted an additional partition to secure his personal office apart from the main office, he could do so with a third partition since he has the flexibility to have up to four separately monitored areas. John can also assign his office manager access to only the single office partition, but can assign his operations manager access to both the office and warehouse partitions. In the event John needs to grant temporary access, he can do so to one or more partitions. Let's take a closer look at the user experience. With this new partitioning feature, Customers can access partitions from the portal, the Cox Business Security Solutions mobile app, or the panel in their office, based on the security rights established for them. The process to add users is the same, and there is now an additional option to assign by partition. Panel users can be assigned to one or multiple partitions with permanent, temporary, or timed access. With up to four partitions and 255 sensors, things could get confusing. We've made it easy for customers to customize their system by applying custom names to their partitions and sensors, which allows for easy identification within the partition assignment. Users set up partition and sensor names on the portal and can view them on the portal, panel, or mobile app. Customers can use the panel to assign sensors to applicable partitions by adding, moving, or deleting sensors as needed. If a sensor is deleted from partitions 2, 3, or 4, it will default back to partition 1, but is not deleted from the system. Let's look at John's setup. He's placed the IQ2 panel as the touchscreen for partition 1, and has decided to keep this partition in the main office. The IQ remote is the touchscreen for partition 2 in the warehouse. John has a few Z-Wave devices attached to his system thermostat to regulate the office temperature, and outlets to control the office lights. These Z-Wave devices are only available on Partition 1 on the IQ2 panel and cannot be assigned to the remotes. Cox Business Security Services' new alarm partitioning service adds layers of flexibility and convenience for our customers to provide secure access to the right people when they need it.